Scars was a 13 year old girl who was shy and didn't have many friends. And it was Christmas. Yay! And her dad told her that he got her a Christmas gift for her 13th year of life on Earth. She was excited. She knew that her dad didn't have much money and she had no clue that she was actually going to get anything for Christmas. She was excited and she said, well, dad, you didn't have to get me anything. And he's like, well, I called Santa and Santa said I had to get you something for Christmas. So I got you something from Target. I got you scars. My favorite daughter, my only daughter, I got you from Target. I'm sorry, this is all I could afford. A dino mask. And Scars was so sad because she thought she was going to get some electronic device like a VR headset. But instead, she got a dino mask from Target. He told her that he's sorry and that it's all he could afford and she was crying and crying because she really wanted a VR headset. So Scars was relaxing in her room, bored and very disappointed, but she put on the dino mask and she thought she looked kind of cool. She looked in the mirror, she said, you know, this looks kind of cool. Maybe I should wear this to school tomorrow. I don't know. She said, maybe I should, maybe I shouldn't. She couldn't make up her mind. But she thought she looked pretty cool in the mask. She wore the mask outside in the backyard and she jumped around, did things, you know, had fun wearing the dino mask. She decided to take it to school the next day. And of course, the biggest bully in school made fun of her and pointed and laughed. And it was such an embarrassment that the bully was making fun of her and he called her weird. And he said that, well, you do this and that, and you're probably like this. And it just was a whole bunch of bullying. And Scars got really sad, put down her mask, and started crying. Crying in school, one of the most embarrassing places to cry. Scars was so sad. She was so sad. She said to herself she was never going to wear that dino mask ever again. So for almost an entire year that dino mask sat in her room and now it was sitting in the living room and her dad said well you're 14 years old and I got you a Christmas gift again I'm sorry for last year I'm so sorry and she said you don't understand dad I wore that dino mask to school last year and everybody made fun of me especially the biggest bully in school. <laughs> I'm so sad. It was such an embarrassment. All I wanted last year was a VR headset. Don't you understand, Dad? Why can't you buy me nice things? And he said, well, I did buy you a nice thing. I bought you this arts and craft kit. You can make arts and crafts. You can paint. You can draw. You can do things. So she sat in her room that day looking at her arts and crafts set, and she got an idea. She said, why don't I use this arts and crafts set and decorate my dino mask? So she started and she had fun decorating her dino mask for the first time. She thought, wow, this has started to look way cooler than it ever looked before. So as she put all these cool things on her dino mask, she said, you know what? I really want to show this off to the world. I think I'm going to take it to school, even though it's not the best idea. So after she put her arts and crafts skills to work and she finished her mask, she was so excited and happy with the results. She decided, even though it wasn't the best idea, she took it to school. And of course, the biggest bully saw her again. But the biggest bully said, you know what? It actually looks kind of cool, to be honest. 
it's not that embarrassing. I like what you did with it. You really took that mask to the next level. And then somebody that she's never talked to, Scars met a new friend, and the new friend said, I love your mask, it is so cool. And then guess what? They became best friends, bestie westies, and they just met, and then they hung out outside of her house, and they danced and played, and she always wore her mask, and he thought it was so cool, and he was curious, like, how did you make such a cool mask? And she said, you know, someday I'll show you. And then even the bully showed up to the neighborhood, and he said, you know, can I be part of your friend group? And then all three of them hung out from now on. They were all going to be bestie westies. And then they all made masks, because she showed them how to make masks. So the bully and the best friend became friends all together. They always hung out all the time at her place and had a great time. Well, guess what? She's 15 years old now. And the dad was very upset and angry because she always wore the mask and he didn't understand it. He didn't understand this Therian thing. But you know what? Even though he didn't understand it at first, he learned to appreciate it. And he saw how much fun she was having with her friends and everything. And he accepted her for who she was. And he stopped judging her. And they became the bestie westies for life. Hanging outside, always wearing their masks that they made. And they were so proud of being Therians. I mean, sometimes life gives you lemons and you make lemonade.